Hey everyone, I'm Ann Munition, and welcome to your exclusive backstage tour of the Overwatch League here at the Blizzard Arena. Make some noise, Blizzard Arena, because it's time to get it started. Go six, lose your graphic. Millions of viewers have watched Overwatch League matches in its inaugural season. That's why I'm excited to share with you everything that goes into the live broadcasts. Let's go backstage as the countdown to the live match begins and access the amazing operations you never even knew existed. Tell me what being a super fan means to you. I've been living in Cupertino by myself for the past four months, so I don't know anybody here. I leave work on Friday, and I drive on down I-5, and it takes about six or so hours to get down here. And the coolest thing is with the community that we have, you're going to make friends when you go there. It's true about the Overwatch League. Everybody's there to have a good time, and it's just so much fun. I'm more of like a shy person, and I never wanted to be known as a super fan. It just kind of happened, it evolved. I remember from like stage one being scared of the cameras and trying to hide to like where we are now where I'm sitting in the front row with signs and stickers on my face. So it's really nice to like, I feel like I progress as a person and becoming a super fan in the process is pretty nice. While the fans prep for the match, the arena operations crew is prepping for them. My name is Sig. I am the director of global live events for Overwatch and Overwatch League. This is the entrance, the lobby of the Blizzard Arena. Our incredible in-house team built that LED screen so that we open the door on the opening day of the inaugural season. People would be greeted with that. Behind all these is our very unique League merch. Everything that you see was designed by the Overwatch League and Blizzard Entertainment. This is exactly how the fans walk in to the studio. There's 500 panels on these LED screens. When you walk in, you walk into this feeling, and especially when you see a map reveal and the whole, every single pixel in this room, 28 million pixels become the map. You actually hear like a <gasps> people's breath being taken away because it's such an incredible moment in the fan experience. For the players, uh, let's go someplace that nobody ever gets to go. The players actually come up here, and these are the player desk. So that's the player's view right here. Here at the Blizzard Arena, we have exactly 530 seats that we fill up with people of all walks of life. And what's amazing is that's our fan base. It's. Uh, it's kids, it's teenage kids, it's kids even younger than that. It's moms, it's dads. I mean, we've had some incredible moments in this arena already this season. Truly behind the scenes is the second floor of the Blizzard Arena. That's where we are right now with all these great posters of other Blizzard Live eSports events. We've got our press room. We actually have a half a dozen interview rooms and secondary rooms for press. But we also have what is kind of like the land that nobody sees. This is the Skybox. This is where league officials, Nate Nanzer, the commissioner of the league, and also all the team owners hang out up here. And what's really cool about Overwatch that's different than any other sport or league is all of our team owners use this space together. Normally these screens are lit up with the games playing, and this is the view of the Overwatch league from way up high. It's really incredible because it's not just the fans coming to see something get produced. The fans and our team are this incredible family. So with your group of super fans, do you feel like you're actually following a touring band or, you know, what does it feel like to have that little close-knit group? Yeah, it's honestly really rewarding. It's really, really cool having such a tight-knit group of people who I can call my friends now. Um, going into like the stage three finals, London wasn't in it. I showed up and out of nowhere, two of the hype people for uh, the two LA teams, they come up to me and say, squash, come here, join our cheering section. So I'm just sitting there right in the middle with all the Los Angeles fans cheering on their teams. Everybody likes each other here and that's just really, really unique and really special. As the fans settle in, the all-important task of readying the production and tech begins. Join us in the next episode for a closer look backstage at the Overwatch League.